so I'm legitimately halfway through a hunt stalking red deer up in northern Victoria. I know for a fact the reds are actually just down there in a paddock, so I'm just waiting for them to come up into this bush territory while we can take a shot. And I thought I'd take the time to talk about uh, deer collars and how you can use and some of the tips that I've learned over the years, because not everyone does. Now, this here is a uh, flex mark as a samba collar, but it actually works for reds and fallow as well. And the main idea behind a deer collar is you, you obviously use the deer collar, it's like a whistle, and it draws attention to the deer. And what it does depending on the time of the year and the type of deer you're calling will pull them towards you so what you want to do is you want to get to an area where you know the deer are at and then you can use this to get their attention and it, you know deer are curious animals and so you'll literally see the does or the hinds or whatever you're looking for kind of pick up their ears because the most callers are designed to attract does uh, it makes the sound of like a young deer so you'll attract does, you'll attract pregnant does, you'll attract yearlings that are looking for mum. Um, during the time of the rut, you'll also attract stags using this as well, because obviously they're on the hunt for does. So what you do is essentially find a spot, bunker down, tend to have a tree at your back or something that can cover you, make a call, and then you wait and you listen. And you listen for the sound of deer coming, the direction they're coming in, you watch them. All right, before we go any further, let me take 30 seconds to talk about Australia's best hunting club and why you should join. Then we'll go back to the video. Hunting Trips Australia has the best hunting club in the country, as well as just stock standard inclusions like public liability hunting insurance and genuine reason to own a firearm. Membership also includes awesome perks like monthly hunting product giveaways, bi-monthly guided hunt giveaways, hunting product and course discounts, weekly early access to the Huntsman videos, an exclusive invitation to the annual camp and a bunch more. So get your butt over to huntingtrips.com.au slash membership and join Australia's best hunting club. I'll see you there. But you could also use this as a tool of camouflage, which is quite interesting and not a lot of people talk about it. What I mean by this is if you're creeping up on a herd of deer and you want to get close, you can legitimately get close to them and you're making noise and then you can make a call. Um, and essentially what that does is the deer are always listening for sounds and they're always kind of taking note of things and, and making judgment calls and kind of labeling things. And so if you can get close to a herd of deer, uh, they will hear you, they will know you're coming. And then if you can make a call and stand still, they then can make the assumption that you're a deer and that's what that sound is. So what they do is they label you as a deer and they ignore you, which means you can make a little bit more noise, you can maybe even get a little bit closer. I've even been in situations before where I've stopped, a deer has seen me, I've stopped moving. I've waited till it's turned, made the call, it looks back, it looks directly at me and just goes, oh, that's a deer, it's fine. And then it's been, you know, <laughs> really cruising. I've been able to get up and get a shot. So deer calling is really good. I encourage you if you haven't checked it out. There's a whole bunch of different types you can get uh, for different species of deer. There's also electronic callers that you can buy as well. I encourage you. They're so light and cheap. Take them out with you. Um, put them under your shirt. Put them on a lanyard, whatever, uh, and use them because they will dramatically increase the amount of deer that you see uh, and also deer that you have a shot at. Good luck on get back to the hunt. Hopefully I haven't missed any deer while I've been filming this. Wait, wait, before you go and watch another video, make sure you go check out the website that I made, huntingtrips.com.au. If you're looking for an Australian guided hunt or hunting course or safari or property to hunt on, it's the best place to find it. It's a great way to support me and a great way to find an amazing hunting experience.